the 3412 is a recent request that we have received on our channel from a number of our viewers. This formation is a variation of the 352 and is interesting because of its flexibility. Moreover the formation coincides with the recent trend of only placing one player on each wing, thus making it easier to create overloads in the center of the pitch both during attack and also during defense. These two wide players are quite understandably, the players responsible for providing width during attacking phases of the game, while also adjusting their positioning depending on how much pressure the ball carrier is on. The three at the back can also easily transition into a four at the back system, if the central of the centre-backs pushes up into the number six role and the other two centre-backs tuck inside. This can make it extremely difficult for the opposition to press, because they will also have to adapt to a constantly changing build-up shape. The same flexibility is given to the three central midfielders who can alternate flexibly between a single and double pivot, system depending on how the opposition are playing. The final variation we will discuss in this video is an interesting box-shaped midfield, which can be created if one of the two forwards can play as a half-space player. This will result in a flexible shape where the team will at times have six players in midfield but also have players close enough to support the center forward during the transition into attack, thus making it extremely difficult for the opposition to defend. If we begin our discussion with the build-up versus a high press, we can quickly see that the flexibility of the back three ensures a numerical advantage, even if the opposition press with two forwards. Moreover, even if the opposition press well using a cover shadow to cut passing options to a centre-back, the incorporation of the goalkeeper in the build-up would allow for numbers forward to create overloads in more progressive areas of the pitch. This formation gets interesting as soon as one of the centre-backs are able to get past the first line of opposition defence. The numerical advantage that the centre-back can create when dribbling forward with the ball will often trigger a cascade of spaces, opening up if they are not able to stay disciplined as more opposition players get drawn towards the ball carrier. The ball played out wide is made more effective because of the way that the formation naturally lines up with two forward players. This means that spaces open up behind the final line of opposition defence as soon as the full-backs get dragged out wide. One interesting variation that we have seen is that of the box shape for man midfield transition. This is created by one of the forward players drifting situationally into the half spaces creating more options in midfield, and forcing the opposition to defend compact which in turn creates space in the wide areas. The central attacking midfielder can also choose to stay centrally especially if the ball is played out wide in order to create situational overloads and help the team to break further lines of opposition defense. The 3 or 5 at the back system is also useful in defensive phases of the game. This formation allows for the centre-backs to defend aggressively if the opposition somehow manage to get the ball into central areas of the pitch since there are still two centre-backs plus the wing-backs if they are able to tuck in fast enough. This formation, as with the regular 3-5-2 formation is also able to deal with wide attacks from the opposition by transitioning into a 4-4-2. In order for this to work the wing-backs are required to be active and constantly adjusting their positions to find the right moment to press. Generally at number 1-2, we like to advise our players to start running at the opposition as the pass is played, so that you are there to apply pressure as the opposition player is receiving the ball and taking their first touch. If the rest of the back five tuck in towards the side of the ball, a four at the back is formed which is optimal to defend against the three forward system that seems to be in trend recently. Since the midfield three are already positioned centrally they just need to make sure that they are organized, and the whole team will be able to defend compact and trap the opposition. 